All right. Okay. All right, family. So, um, are you ready to take a journey? Questions. We're going to take questions first. And then we're going to get into the predictions because we've been getting a lot of inboxes. First of all, welcome to the spiritual vault. Peace and blessings to find me. I am Wunam, aka Nikki Love, your African Indigenous traditional healer. And I am Brother Adinkra, your African Indigenous traditional healer. You are a true reflection of the universe. Jupiter. Jupiter with the storm. Yeah, Jupiter storm. Now, y'all. And when that happened, it was a full moon that night, too. Well, well, let me tell y'all this. The Jupiter storm, Jupiter is the most spiritual planet in the universe. And Jupiter is 10 times bigger than the Earth, but it protects the Earth from being uh, attacked by, um, what do you call it? Meteors, meteorites. But also the energy it protects the Earth. But Jupiter had a storm, which is also responsible for our um spiritual transformation because not only is the most spiritual planet um the beings of jupiter are highly highly spiritual they're responsible for our spirituality here on earth so the storm the night the storm was we had a full moon now y'all have to pay attention because everybody's so focused on what's going on down here on the earth covid variant this that this is that they're not in the jab well, that jab, but, um, but they're not focusing on what's going on in the cosmos and the beings that are here. The other night we heard some stuff going on. They was rumbling around up there <laughs> in the goddamn cosmos. Yeah. And I was like, uh-huh, that ain't thunder. They rub, they fighting up there. And it was raining hard. It was raining real hard. Real hard. And we kept going, it wasn't, you know how thunder, you it just sounded like, thumb, right. It sounded like somebody beating on the wall, like boom, 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 boom. Yeah, like somebody, yeah. And I was like, okay, all right. So anyway, family, but saying that, um, do pay attention to what's going on in the cosmos. Mm -hmm. Do pay attention because there's a lot that's going on in the cosmos, but not to mention what's coming out of that uh, Atlantic Ocean. Okay? What's coming out of the Atlantic Ocean. You and, guys, what? Now, nah, and they've been, uh, I noticed, have y'all noticed they've been discovering new uh, fish and, and like animals at the sea now? A lot of... Every week it seems like I'm reading about new animals and stuff they discovered, either on Earth or, or the uh, sea, coming out the sea. Let me see something, y'all, because Facebook ain't... So now let's talk about the Atlantic Ocean, okay? Hmm. Y'all see the storms coming up out the Atlantic? Now, we've been having a lot of rain here. They said there's going to be enough rain in the week that will cover the whole month. That was missed out on rain. So we're mm -hmm. saying that um, it's kind of calm right now. You'll notice the calm a little bit. But you know they say before the storm comes to calm. Well, I say it that way. They'll say before the calm comes to storm, or before the st before the storm comes to calm. So when it gets calm and quiet like it is right now, do do pay attention. Don't get comfortable. Don't get happy. <laughs> Stock up on your food. Get some flashlights, get some candles, and get ready. Because it's too goddamn quiet right now. But wait, in about a week or two, a week or two, y'all wait. A week or two, you won't see. There's going to be some storms coming down the East Coast, coming down the West Coast. So y'all, I'm telling y'all, get ready. See my, li my, my Larry says uh, Alabama, Alabama is flooding. See, Alabama's flooding. Um, we've had some floods here in Georgia. Um, Y'all getting ready to see a lot more flooding. Um, uh, and and place, now, yeah, places where it's never flooded. Right. Not only that, in many places, you know, like, okay, we'll say the East Coast is coming down. Well, it's going to be the East Coast, West Coast, North, and the South. So we're going to have an abundance of water coming to all of the states. All of the mm -hmm. states, whether you're east, north, west, or south, okay? There's going to be another uh, uh, um, earthquake, too. It's going to need, uh, I don't know why I keep picking up Mississippi, but they had an earthquake in South Carolina last week, 2.9 on the Raptor scale. But there's going to be another earthquake. Um, and let me tell you, I keep seeing two more earthquakes coming, okay? There's going to be one in the West Coast, too. And then they keep showing me Mexico. I don't know why they keep showing me Mexico. I don't know. Mexico may have an earthquake, too. So, um, yeah, that's what I see for uh, the weather, but also to family, I don't know, Japan, I don't know if there's a tsunami coming to Japan 
or a, another major earthquake coming to uh, Japan um, overseas, okay? Um, Texas, be careful. Flooding is coming to Texas again, too. Shit, that's heavy, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Texas. Shit. Uh, again, Louisiana. Mm-hmm. Uh, my Scorpio... Persia says that uh, Europe Europe is underwater, uh, Spain cities, and France also. See what I'm saying? Like, yeah. So you gotta, you all have to remember this is the age of Aquarius. Mm -hmm. Not Aquarius is air, but it's also the water. Okay. So with that being said, because we are at the beginning of the end, we are getting ready to see all this stuff. The water has to wash. Water is the most powerful element on the planet. So with saying that. Because we have to go through this transformation, we're at the beginning. Um, a lot of things have to be washed away. So you're going to see a lot of water, a lot of water, okay? And it's going to be everywhere because there's a cleansing that must take place. So when we see this amount of water flooding, countries, cities going underwater like that, it's just time for the transformation. And, it, and it's a transformation taking place, and it has to be cleansed, okay? That's mother... Um, washing her womb and rebirthing and rebirthing, rebirthing the energy to the planet. Okay, so that's what's going on. Um, Nicole says the birds were going crazy for the past week. Yeah, really? I've seen a few of them. I've seen a few of them going crazy. Yeah, I've seen a few of them. Yeah, uh, my Larry says it rained. <coughs> it rained also in uh, SoCal, LA, SoCal as well. Which is unusual for them. Hmm. Yeah, well, they ain't seen nothing yet. A lot of people are moving out of L.A. A lot of people and, moving yeah, out of L.A. But of, and, and New York now. And New York, <laughs> Texas. We've been seeing a lot of Ohio place, Texas place, New York place. I'm telling y'all, people are fleeing. Out California, they're coming from California. People are fleeing. Why are they coming to Atlanta? Because they know something y'all don't know. 